Coming up now on 530. Hope your Wednesday's off to a great start. Looking down on almost all of Albuquerque there. Uh, we're about to ride out a cool down here. One that is going to bring some stronger winds to the state. Uh, there will be some rain chances also kicking in as well, favoring western and northern New Mexico. Uh, we should be able to push well the cool down, the wind and any rain chance back out of the state in time to uh, really time out a nice April weekend, but getting there next few days is going to be a bit interesting. Uh, still in the 70s and 80s near record highs. Clouds do build this afternoon. I think central, western, northern New Mexico will have to watch for these isolated afternoon and evening gusty thunder showers. Some of it could just be Virgo, which is rain that evaporates before it reaches the ground, but that just makes it windier. Uh, any scattered showers will tend to wind down overnight. Patchy clouds around uh, should hold above freezing statewide, and a lot of us will hold above 50 degrees once again for those uh, overnight low temperatures. Uh, we're only going to step down the temperature slightly on Thursday. It will be a windier day. Rain will be scarce, but any areas that do see a couple of showers will be uh, up around Santa Fe, perhaps northern New Mexico. But we don't expect much out there Thursday. It's kind of a break from the rain chance. Then on Friday, windier, better chance at scattered rain and mountain snow showers for central and especially northern New Mexico. We are dropping those highs into the 50s and 60s, at least for the northern part of the state. And I think the winds are strong enough on Friday to consider it an impact weather day. We are talking about the potential for gusts 40 to 45 for many New Mexico communities on Friday afternoon and evening. And you know, it's that time of year. There's so many outdoor activities. And we're trying to get those uh, high school sports being played. A lot of that stuff scheduled for Friday nights. It's going to be a bit rough out there. Uh, scattered to isolated showers and storms with some Virgo uh, spitting out wind gusts here in the mix in northwest New Mexico. It'll be quiet into the lunch hour first half of the afternoon, uh, but it could be a little busy here this evening and into the first half of the overnight, but we're back in the 70s and 80s. We'll drop at 10 tomorrow and about another 10 Friday as the strong winds hit. A few more showers Friday, but look at your weekend. How about sunshine 64 Saturday 70 on Sunday southwest New Mexico also with a slight chance of an isolated gusty thunder shower uh, with highs in the 70s and 80s today uh, to two days of strong winds here Thursday Friday and the dropping temperatures, but the weekend has us back into the 70s and so Silver City. Look at the high of 90 today in Roswell, 89 for Artesia and Carlsbad. Going to be toasty warm in southeast New Mexico. We'll stay dry here in this corner of the state and then have to deal with the winds. Temperatures drop 10 into Friday and then kind of hang out in a pretty sweet spot for the weekend. Roswell, Saturday 79, Sunday 82. Here's northeast New Mexico. Also, not really worried about this threat of an isolated gusty thunder shower. Warm, breezy afternoon, though highs well into the 70s. Windier Thursday, windiest Friday. Uh, that's a high of 60 by Friday, uh, but we do see a bit of a bounce back for the weekend with sunshine. Here's Santa Fe, north central New Mexico. Any isolated gusty thunder shower would occur late in the day, probably this evening. Highs will be in the 70s to about 80 degrees before that does happen. Probably timing out a dry one tomorrow and then Friday. That's highs in the 50s with a shower and some gusty winds. Here's Albuquerque. Uh, record high is 84. Hit 80 yesterday. Got today's high at 82. Just too shy of the record. 10% chance that an isolated gusty thunder shower late. Uh, not as warm, but still way above average. Windy tomorrow. Windiest Friday. Another slight chance at a shower, but it's all gone by the weekend. Weekend looks great and it'll be warm again early next week.